Military Makeover is brought to you in part by Nautica and ADT. We're in Bradenton, Florida at the home of Army veteran Aaron Cornelius. Together with an army of volunteers, this military makeover is in full swing. But we still have a long way to go before Aaron and his family can move back in. So let's check in and see how things are going. Ryan Stanley is our construction manager. He's the heart of the operation, giving everything he's got to make things happen. I love demoing ugly kitchens. Jennifer Bertrand is our interior designer. She's responsible for making a home for our veterans, a place to help them start a new life. I cannot wait to show them what fun things are in store for them. Marcus Luttrell is the newest addition to our team. He's the eyes, ears, and boots on the ground. Right. Morning already? And yours truly, my name is Art Edmonds. I coordinate all the partners and volunteers we need in order to make these dreams a reality for our veterans. I know you're the one in charge. I'm just telling you what we need. Together, we're Team Military Makeover. And this is Operation Cornelius Family. We got a lot going on right now. We got stuff all over the yard. The AC guys have pulled out all the duct work. It's laying over here. With all the vehicles and people moving around, we just don't got room for all this stuff to be lying around. Hey, Marcus, what's up, man? What's up, Good brother? to see you. You too. I see they already got you going to work. Oh, right? yeah, as soon as I got here. <laughs> well, listen, check this out. So uh, this is sort of like an architectural detail. This is going to be his uh, memorabilia room. You know, he's a big collector. He's got a lot of military uh, memorabilia. Uh, so this uh, is He's got also... that traditional Japanese dojo feel. Yeah, doesn't it? But it's also serving a purpose because he can actually feel his way around the wall. Oh, sure. That's good. Yep. Yeah, so nice. uh, dual use, right? We don't yeah. want to change things too much for him, but we want to be able to uh, let him identify what part of the room he's in. Give me an update on the kitchen. One piece of that granite broke, but yes. I think we can get it in there, but we need to find an installer to get them in and then do the epoxy and buff and fix yeah. the crack that's in it because I read this point we don't have any choice. We have to reuse those yeah. countertops. Let's <laughs> do an art and just sleep. Let's be art. So we should expect it one, right? Well, we're waiting for some floors. Missed delivery, so we got half, we didn't get the other half. It's gonna be tight, but, uh, but we'll make it. These guys will make it. <laughs> Joe, it's great to have you here. And listen, I'm just glad to have that old carpet out. You guys are doing all new flooring for us. I got my guy Marcus <laughs> bringing stuff in over here. Thank you, brother. You Appreciate it. So yeah, the work's gonna happen all around us. Absolutely. So we gotta get this done. Absolutely. Tell me about this great product. So the product is Tarquette Fresh Air. And the reason we call it Fresh Air is because it's certified asthma and allergy friendly. So if anybody has like allergy concerns, they don't have to worry about it with this. It's really meant to look like real wood. In fact, we have multi-width. You have an eight and a four inch I width. I see that. You lay them out next to each other, staggered width. Exactly. And it gives it a real organic so feel. It gives it a natural feel and look just like hardwood but performs way better. So this would be much better against scratching, right. indentations, wear, um, even moisture. And it's so easy to install. You're just putting an underlayment down. It's not a glue down product. You can walk on it right away. Absolutely, and if there's ever an issue where you have to repair a board or something like that, just pull it back and put another one in. I didn't think of that. You just pop it out and they snap right together. I see we've got multiple rooms happening here. The flooring really anchors the space. And you've got a number of different finishes in this product, Tarquette, right? It does. And if you look even just at the number of different colors that you'll see, it just really brings out a lot of the colors in the room if you're looking around. And, and again, just really has a real natural feel to it, but will way outperform traditional hardwood. I see your uh, installers are milling around waiting for us to get out of the way. 100%. So, we got to get yeah, out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here, Thanks, Joe. Great it. job, man. We've got a storm bearing down on us. It shouldn't be a problem. We'll see what happens. I mean, the storms move pretty quick. Out of all the colors you could have picked, uh, desert sands, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? So, I mean, we, we spent so much time out there, the last color we want to see is, I'm going to tell him it's pink anyways. He's not going to know. Oh my god! 
God. He jumped at a window and unfortunately the screen popped out. So now he's in the backyard. So I'm trying to get him back in the house. Last thing I want is for him to get outside the, of the fence and everything. Is in the bag. Everybody, everybody okay? Safe? Happy? It's nasty. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> All right, so you can see we actually already have the air handler set up out here, uh -huh. ready to go. So it's been nice to work in this space right here. And you know, we don't often get to see the actual air handler because it's in a tight space or it's up in the attic. And we always do something a little bit extra. We're doing something with a UV light. Tell us about it. Correct, that. yeah. You're essentially gonna protect the coil from mold formation. So you put a UV light inside of the coil, and so the UV light keeps the air clean. So it's actually a protection for air quality. As you're breathing, you're not getting that particulate matter and the mold and things right, like that. Right, mold grows on your coil, it's blowing off and it's going throughout the home. Now, uh, the installation is not completely done, is it? This this doesn't belong here, right? <laughs> yeah, it's not completely done. In fact, okay. this part is now so easy, you could probably even do this part. Well, you're saying that I can actually <laughs> install the AC? You can jump right in. So yeah. what do I gotta do? Just kinda crank so, it? You just start cranking it, and we're gonna lift it right up into the ceiling. Look at that. Look at that, and they say that I don't do any work on this show. I just installed the AC. Listen, that's but that's only half of it. The rest of right. it's outside, that's where the compressor is, and that's what we want to take a look at next. Yeah. Yep. Let's, Let's do go. it. Three of you painting in the My Computer Career Room, and then um, even if you guys want to, oh, sorry, I might have accidentally spit on torture direction. <laughs> I caught it, we're good. We only have three more to go. Now your room in the house is the most important because it is giving him all the things he loves and doing it like independently. So his DJ stuff, the computer independence, all of that. So who are the three people that are gonna paint the room? Okay, good. Get excited, this is gonna be fun. You're gonna like it. You'll love it, you'll love it. Taking up the rear, you're gonna have fun. Okay, carpenters, we're gonna take one by twos and we're gonna create triangle panels. Doesn't that seem cool? Oh, that's gonna yeah. be awesome. So the whole goal is that obviously he can't see the makeover, but we want him to like feel it. Got all the heavy stuff. Go ahead and bring those in because as of yesterday, we didn't even know we were getting these, so I don't even know what's in the boxes. So how many are there? A lot. Okay, so let's line them up here. I have to do a lot of delegating, so it sounds like I'm bossing people around but not doing any work. But someone has to be the conductor of people and pull it off. What about the colors? Are you liking the colors? No. For real? No. <laughs> really? Yeah. You don't like blue? I was in the prison. No. Oh my God. <laughs> That's what I was going for. One of the animals appears to have a very swollen bladder and we got in touch with a local veterinarian who was going to not only get their shots up to date, he's gonna take care of them. Starting route to Pet First Animal Hospital. Before we get swept away in the rain. We have three out of four cats. Do you have any names on the kitty? Yes. Yeah. Mia, Melanie, Milan, and Mischief. This is Erin. Tell who what your lighting store is. Bee Ridge Lighting. Yay, and okay, so they're donating a ceiling fan for the living room, some a lighting for the dining table. Honestly, we cannot thank you enough, and like, this is lovely chic lighting, and that's your brother, isn't it? Yes, it is, he, he totally ditched you. I'm yeah. Jen, thank Hello. you so much for helping uh, with the oh, lighting. Oh, for sure, we're excited to Yay. help. Lighting is one of the things that people usually mess up in their own homes. They chicken out, they buy the smaller light, and if you play with scale and do it right, you'll freak out, you'll be like, oh, it's a spaceship, it's so big, and then you'll realize later it's the proper scale. This is gonna be amazing. Thanks, you guys, yeah. you're so awesome. You're awesome, thank you.
So this is the unit that everybody's familiar with. It sits outside the house, it houses the compressor. Uh, tell us about this particular Goodman unit. This heat pump is going to match up with the indoor unit, the air handler we just looked at. It's going to match perfectly to deliver the maximum efficiency. And we're replacing a 10-year-old unit, so hopefully this is gonna lower their monthly bills and make things a little easier that way. How about installation? You know, in a qualified contract like AC Warehouse is gonna take care of all of that for us. Well, we've got the best crew in the business and I know they're, you know, chomping at the bit to get this installed, so I think we should get out of their way, right? Right. Agreed. I can't wait to see this bad boy installed. Uh-huh. Thanks. All right, let's go hang out. Our program was originally designed for career changers. And so we helped them make a career change to get into the computer industry. Veterans are the ultimate career changers, uh, particularly those who are right in the middle of a transition out of the military. They struggle with a lot of things trying to make that transition. Our program is designed extremely well for those veterans who are trying to make that transition back into the civilian world. Ladies. Hey. Hey. What's going on? What, how am I? How are you? You're doing all the hard work here. This is going to be Aaron's music escape room, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. So, you know, every time that you guys, mycomputercareer.edu, are on Military Makeover, you always try to take a special room, make it into a special proge project for the veteran. And uh, this is no exception. We're taking the space using his passion for music, his passion for, he loves audiobooks. Yep. His passion for DJing. Yes, he's a professional DJ. Isn't that cool? Yes, it is. Yeah. So, so not only are you doing design work, but you want to help with his computer and his DJ equipment. Yeah, which is great, except for the fact that none of it started yet. Well, what are so you going to be doing? We're going to be building a computer from scratch. We have a tech team here, um, students, graduates, employees. They're here to build the computer from the ground up. Wow. Uh, lots of cool specifications so that he can game, so that he can do his DJing, uh -huh. all that, you know, digital music stuff. Yes, awesome. Again, would be even cooler if we were a little farther than that. Okay, well, so what you're saying is talking to me is taking up time. Definitely. I get it. Ladies, keep up the good work. I'll check in with you later. Awesome. And we'll see how far the progress has evolved. Awesome. Thanks, Art. All right. See you later. The countdown is on, so we got to get all of our flooring done, all of our trim out work done, so we can start putting furniture in this place as the days roll on. And with us again from Tarkat Flooring, good to see you. What is Thank this? Uh, I know you're still about to install, but right. this is what some old school linoleum thing. And what are you, are you playing a joke on us or what? No, not a linoleum at all. The common misconception is that everyone thinks they have true linoleum in their kitchen. If you ask them, I have linoleum. That's really not linoleum. This is fiber reinforced sheet vinyl. Sheet so, vinyl. So check this out. It's got actual grout lines in it. You can feel the indentation. Of right. It. There's texture for a realistic pattern. We have over 100 designs in this fiber floor line. It is 100% waterproof from spills. We're actually going to use the glueless option or the floating option. So we're going to install this really quickly. And then just trim it out around it and it'll Absolutely. hold it down. Trim it out, leave, leave some room for the quarter round to finish out the space. But we're not going to use any adhesive and that's going to open up the room afterwards for the other trades to do their work and keep you guys rolling. Wow, that is amazing. So I needed the fence taken down. That's how you do it right there. I'm not kidding, guys. The fence looks great. I mean, you say your specialty is in electronics, but you guys are some help. I'm carpenter, too, but it looks good. Yeah, well, Air Force Marines, we know how to work. Being all veterans, you know that service is more than just the veteran doing the work. So it's a support system. It's the family that's supporting this veteran. They're all serving, too. Even the service animals are supporting. Yeah. And uh, with, the, with the hurricane that came through, they knocked out the old fence. They couldn't put the dogs out here to have some downtime to run around and do their own thing. All they could do was walk them. So we wanted to give the opportunity, not just for the family to relax out here, but also the service dogs to get some of the respect they're due. The service dogs are an extension of the family. So yeah, yeah. good job, guys. Really, seriously, that's good, man. Thank you. Thank you. Kevin, it's great to have ADT back on board for another military makeover. A couple of things that are really interesting about this install and the new system is that ADT really has their finger on the pulse of technology, so to speak. And, and that's actually the name of your application and the system that we're upgrading, right? Correct. Yeah, our, our, 
home automation version of, of what we do is, is ADT Pulse. Right. Um, right now what we're doing is upgrading the existing control panel, putting in all the, the sensors, all of the uh, uh, perimeter security devices. And then once all that's set up, we get it programmed and then we can move on to setting up all the automation pieces for, for the Pulse system. Anything special that we have to do to make this ADA compliant for Aaron? So one thing that we're actually installing is audible keypads. So if, if there's a potential danger, it's not only gonna you know, set the alarm off, but it's gonna tell him where that danger is. Now, this can be integrated with Alexa and any sort of voice command system that you may have, right? He'll be able to use voice control through the Amazon Alexa system to remotely arm and disarm the security system, close the garage door. We'll be able to integrate pretty much everything that we can do with this, the alarm system through voice command, so it makes it very easy for him to use. That's great. Well, listen, get back to work, my friend. We are on a tight timeline, and I'll check back with you later in the makeover. Thank you. So I thought the granite was broken and beyond repair, but these guys are amazing. They figured out a way to do it. Um, I went and got a bigger sink. We're going to recut the hole to try to hide some of the cracks and stuff, so I think it's all going to work out just fine. Today we are at uh, Norris Furniture with uh, Jennifer and Keely. Hi, you guys! Oh, Yay, you get excited! Yes. So this is when the fun begins. We are going to hang out with my new best friend, Keely, and we're going to do some furniture shopping. You get to tell me your wish list, and then um, we see if I listen. Like, what do you guys look for in a couch? Um, Comfort. Comfort? Yeah, who yeah. doesn't? Coziness. I'm trying to figure out what this family needs and what will make their home look amazing but also function. We like big beds because we like to stretch out and, you know, he's, he's <laughs> my big bear here. <laughs> the important part, I felt this part, it feels good. Comfort. Yeah. This is a live edge table. I was surprised at their reactions. They just loved everything, so it's going to be hard to find things that we really think are perfect for them. There were a couple American leather pieces that I kind of secretly spied in the showroom that I'm going to use for you guys, probably, okay. but you're just going to have to wait and see. And Keely, you're the nice best turn. guide ever. Thank you so much. Okay, so apparently here's what we got. There's something up there that's so big that even the cats won't mess with it. I'm gonna take the first watch. I got exterminator duty. Here we go. I'd say we're in pretty good hands with Marcus on first watch. Jerry, it hurts. Despite all the challenges we've faced so far, this makeover is really starting to take shape. Aaron and Melissa are going to be thrilled with the transformation. We still have a few challenges ahead of us and some final touches to take care of. All will be revealed on the next Military Makeover.